Shouting in the middle of the bazaar. They surprised me. You How was I supposed to know they Five had years you? of What's your problem? Hey, aren't you the pilgrim they wanted to hang? Man, you were in luck there. I could use some of that luck. I'm Alberto's apprentice. Not for long, probably. It's the third time I'm taking a shot at this test. If I fail again, Craftmaster Alberto's gonna kick me out. What's this test about? Our goats. They're kept in cages because they eat crops. But life in cages makes them sad, and they give less milk. So I came up with the idea of a fence, energized with just a tiny bit of voltage. That would keep the goats under control, but let them produce more milk. I called this invention the electric fence. So what seems to be the problem with this invention of yours? I just need some electric parts. I'll dismantle them for resistors and other useful things. I'm missing a few parts, and they're not that easy to get. I'm worried I won't be ready on time. Maybe you could help me. If you find them for me, I'll give you one of my super cool inventions. Nothing to do with goats, I hope. Nah, something much more interesting. You'll see, as far as I know, they could be found in two places. One's an old hardware store on Fitzwilliam Place, near the water tower. Alberto says they'll be there for sure, but it's a dark place, full of turned creatures. You have to go there at night. And the other option? Whatever's left of military patrols. I know of one place south of Horseshoe, near the old electrical substation. <laughs> Looks like you're in luck after all. I have the parts you need on me. Are you serious? That's just fantastic! Heaven must have sent you! Here. I don't know how to thank you. One more thing. Could you help me set up my show? My installation's right outside the main entrance. Turn it on, please. I'll go get Alberto. Wait till he sees it. Meet me by the goat pen, then. Near the wall. Someone's been stealing our water. Nobody's doing anything about it. Aiden, Such a how's it been, kid? Got a taste for city life yet? Uh, I've been here and there. You know, the best part is always happening in the center. And that's where we're going. I have a plan for how to get there. I'll tell you everything on the spot. Meet me on the roof, near the main metro station. on the conflict with the renegades. There have been several... 
Hakon. Ah, you're a better climber than one crazy girl I used to know. <laughs> she was something. She even wanted to climb the tallest building in the city. The VNC Tower. <laughs> was she one of your wives? Almost. Too hot-tempered. Even for my tastes. What about this passage to the center? Right. Look, from this roof you can clearly see the Peacekeeper's base. Wait, you brought me here to take a look at the peacekeepers? The PK are your ticket to the center. I told you the only way to get there is through the metro tunnels. I'll go inside and draw their attention away from the platform. Then you enter the metro technical station. There's an airlock there. We'll take it together to the central loop. We can't just ask them to let me through? No chance. Right now, each new face they see belongs to a suspect in their commander's murder. They know me. I trade with them sometimes. I deliver lamps from the girls, or goods from dark zones. There might be a few infected there. Nothing a pilgrim can handle, though. When you get to the main station, let me know. Now you better get some sleep. You'll head out at night, when there's less infected in the tunnels. Yeah! <laughs> 
Stephen.
I'm in the tunnel. Okay. Now watch out for the infected. There might be a few, or a few dozen. I'm already in the BK base. I'll throw a UV flare through the vent, and you'll see how to get to the main station.
Got to the flare. Look around. The technical tunnel to the main station should be well lit. I've already lured the guards upstairs. I'll chat them up while you get inside. Yeah! 
inside. Five packs. Think about it, and I'll be right back. I'm on the platform. Open the airlock. I'll be there in a second. Where did he come from? He was wandering through the tunnels. Fucking bizarre riffraff. More like a renegade spy. Hmm. <laughs> Doesn't look like a renegade. He's awake. What were you doing at our base? I'm only trying to get to the city center. The center? <laughs> the tunnel's gonna be closed until you hand over Lucas's killers. Bizarre scum. How is it that you lot saw nothing, heard nothing? And you managed to forget about the ban on passage. Maybe we'll start punishing you by cutting off your hands. That would improve your memory, huh? What were you doing four days ago? I'm a pilgrim. Four days ago, I was a hundred kilometers away. Enough, Anderson. We need the truth. And you won't get it through coercion. But Commander Lucas, Lucas always said... Lucas is said... dead. And now I'm in command. You've read the reports. A pilgrim appeared in the bazaar yesterday. It looks like he's not lying. Leave us, Sergeant. I want to talk to him alone. <clears throat> Where did you come from? From Crossdale River. That's over 1,500 kilometers from here. It's actually more than 2,000. The freeway bridge has collapsed. There are no straight paths. And you've managed to make it so far away. Impressive. What's it like out there these days? What's it like outside the walls? You never know where danger's gonna come from. Always new territories, new threats. And you came here to take shelter. I came here because I'm looking for someone. And a lot of people are said to have survived in Villador. You're looking for someone? Hmm, well, maybe I can help you. But not for free. I'm used to trading. What do you need? No nonsense. That's good. The tunnel will be closed until I find our commander's murderer. Commander Lucas. His body was found in the bazaar. Horribly mutilated. The people of the bazaar aren't making this easy. They're proud and loyal. They refuse to turn anyone in. But Command has lost its patience. I have orders from the top, Pilgrim. If the inhabitants of Old Vilador continue to revolt, our army will come here and burn the bazaar to the ground. Now, I'd rather avoid that. And what do you need from me? Lucas had a weapon. A rare set of brass knuckles called the Lazarus. This is the key to finding the killer. If you learn anything about the Lazarus, tell me, and I will most certainly return the favor. It's worth a lot, and we didn't find it on his body. I think someone from the bazaar may have appropriated it. So if I find that weapon, you'll let me through to the center? It's not that easy. Vilador suffered much. First, it was isolated from the outside world because of infection. Then the walls became its salvation. But people here learned not to trust easily. I won't open the passage until I've caught the killer. But if you can find the Lazarus, 
I'll remember that. You'll be the first one through once justice is done. Sounds as if I have no other choice. I'll try. Look around. Ask people. And don't come back empty-handed. Good luck. Questioned. Good. It is kill you. Meet me outside. You must help us. Otherwise, there will be a rebellion. Help us in the investigation. We'll help you with the bandits. I told you already. I got your six. Don't be in the bazaar. So anything to do with Lucas' death. Why won't you did they want from you? Ader said he might let me through to the center, if I help him. What? What are you supposed to help him with? He wants me to find Lucas's weapon, the Lazarus. Went missing from the crime scene. He believes finding it will help find the killer. The Lazarus, huh? Fancy set of brass knuckles, right? I know a guy who trades stolen goods and other shit he gets from thieves. A fence? Part-time fence, full-time scammer, an artless one, too. He's got half the city after him for debts right now. If anyone in Villador is fool enough to buy a peacekeeper weapon, it would be him. What's his name? Hubert Carbatos, also known as Half-Ass Hubie. Every day, he sets up shop in the nearby windmill and waits for customers, probably selling booze and weed to the PKs. If you want to find the Lazarus, talk with Hubie. I'll chase down some other leads. Okay, let's keep in touch. I don't know you're here. 
You Hubert? No, not me. I'm waiting for Hubie too. So get in line. Got it. You know when I'll be here? Maybe in an hour. Maybe two. You never know with old half assed That said, he's got the best moonshine. So, worth the wait. Uh, nothing to do but wait, I guess. Hey, you Hubert? Who's asking? A customer. I want to buy something. Hey, you're that stranger they wanted to hang, aren't you? Hey, Yubi, you got a special customer. It's that pilgrim from the bazaar. B wait, I just want to buy something. So, that was Yubi, wasn't it? Yep. Apparently had an urgent appointment with another customer. Yeah, sure. Hack on. He's running away. Nah, sounds like you be. Hold on. Uh, I see him. Arsenal's running to the northeast. Faster, Aiden. You almost got him. Money back too? Hack on. He's running away. Nah, sounds like you be. Oh, wait a second. I see him. Arsenal's running to the northeast. It's right time. Command deals with the water issue. Faster, Aiden. You almost got him. God. He's not here. Ah, oh, impossible. I saw him right there. That little weasel must be hiding. Look around. Oh, wait, I see him. He's climbing. In a GRE building. He's climbing to the roof.
lost him. But he's got to be on that rooftop, Aiden. Find him. Gilbert! I just want to talk! <laughs> Leave me alone! <laughs> don't hurt me! I don't know anything! About what? I haven't asked you anything yet. I don't know anything about anything, I swear! I'm told that you're a fence, hmm? A fence? No way. A reseller, maybe, but... I'm looking for the Lazarus. Yeah, I used to belong to Lucas, the late PK commander. Hey, don't try to tell me you don't know who Lucas is. Well, then I won't. You know anything about the Lazarus? Are you kidding me? Even if I'd been offered those brass knuckles, I would have refused. I'm not an idiot. That weapon is way too hot. How did you know the Lazarus is a set of brass knuckles, hmm? I didn't say that. Come on! Everyone knew about Lucas's little love glove. He was always showing it off. If anyone thought I had him, they might also think I killed Lucas, which is bullshit. Yeah, but someone tried to sell it to you, right? I told you, I... Okay, fine. Maybe someone did, but I can't say who. Client confidentiality. Stop fucking around. Tell me or I... Her name is Maya. I met her in the tenement building at Meatpacking Square, near the old butcher shop. But I don't know anything else. Leave me alone. It overlooks some army barracks or some shit. All right, I can find that. Hey, hack on. Hubert said someone tried to sell him the Lazarus. Do you know a Maya? No. Strange, because I thought I knew all the women here. I'm headed to Meatpacking Square. Meatpacking Square. It's a fucked up place. There are some barracks there the army set up in 23 when shit went south. She's supposed to be in one of the buildings that overlook them. Okay. Stay in touch, bro.
Why would you even say something like that? This isn't that? kosher, Damien. Just kidding. You need to respect you the rules. You two are a match made in heaven. I'm respectful. No one's more respectful than me, I swear. So who are you working for? Why do they need recruits? She's going off. You'd have to ask them. I'm just doing my job and scouting town. Never. Don't like it.